Hi there. I'm Jessica. Bear with me, I'm not used to this whole online thing. My parents are Bible thumpers, so we weren't allowed to use a computer. Except for that time at church camp, Katie Burroughs and I snuck into Pastor Sidney's office to look at YouTube videos. My parents thought technology would bring sin into our lives. But since I was made vampire, I'm learning there's a lot of sin out there. But maybe it isn't all that bad. So I'm still new with the whole having bangs thing, and I thought there's got to be more of you out there like me. Babies, I think they call us. With no clue at all how to be a goddamn vampire. All the ones I know, they make it look really easy, but it seems like every time I round a corner, I bump right smack into something new. And my maker, Bill Compton, he's never around to teach me anything. I mean, did you know that you were going to cry tears of blood? Or that everything heals? I mean, everything. Yeah, me neither. Way to go, Bill. Thanks for the heads up. Before I was turned, I used to go to a Bible study group once a week. And it was boring as shit, but at least I had people to talk to. Now I don't have anyone. Not even Hoyt. Hoyt's my boyfriend. Or, I guess, my ex-boyfriend. And it gets lonely sometimes. So I guess if anyone is out there, maybe, maybe you could help me. I could maybe help you too. We could figure out some of this shit together. See, like something I'm totally confused about. I got these chills yesterday, and I have no idea why. At first, I thought I was having a dream where Hoyt was in my cubby with me, you know, snoring all loud like he does when he naps sometimes. And then he was gone, and maybe that's why it got so cold. He's human, so his body's really warm. At least that's how I remember it. But I got way bigger problems than silly dreams in Hoyt Fortenberry right now, so I guess that's why I'm reaching out. God, I hope somebody 